Hi everybody, this is Angel. So this afternoon I will be making carrot cake. I have already grated some carrots here. I've already put in this mixing bowl some uh, all-purpose flour, baking powder, baking soda, and some ground cinnamon. Um, the recipe that I got from joyofbaking.com and have printed it. So I am just basically following everything here. So I need some large eggs, four large eggs, and mix it into the mixing bowl. So I need to put the uh, camera right here so I can film this procedure pretty well. So here's the first egg. I'll crack it open. open. That's the first one. vanilla flavor and a granulated sugar a cup and a half of granulated sugar so I have to slowly peel off this alright so how much uh, vanilla extract 2 teaspoons vanilla extract and I need some canola oil but I'll be using this olive oil instead about 240 uh, ml so this bottle is actually 250 so I'll just have to save 10 ml You can use your electric blender, but for me, using this list is fine since I don't have an electric mixer here in this house. So I'll just use the manual one, manually. Then, what else? I have everything. Okay, to the mixer now, it's time to pour some grated carrots into it. Portion first and mix it well. It smells really good. And I'll continue adding the remaining 
There it is in the oven and will be uh, baking for 25 minutes to 3 to 30 minutes. Smells really good. Oh, very hot. That's the first one and I have the second uh, carrot cake mixture here. So it will take an hour to bake them both. And then once they're ready, I'll be off to church for the blessing of the water and candle at San Isidro Catholic Church here in Taft Avenue. So yeah, waiting for my carrot cake to be baked. Now I'm going to make the frosting afterwards. So here are my carrot cakes. First one that I have baked right there. Looking really good and smells so good. And the second um, round tin that already also baked. Now I'm preparing for the frosting. I have uh, already put a quarter cup of solid butter, um, eight ounces of cream cheese, which I have used Philadelphia regular for my cream cheese. Then I'm going to add some sugar and a teaspoon of um, teaspoon of vanilla extract. So here's the rest of the sugar mixture that I'm going to put into the bowl. And I need to add some vanilla extract. That I cannot okay open just a teaspoon okay then I need to get my whisk and mix it very well so I'll be right back and show you the finished frosting so here is the finished product my carrot cake. This one is for Tim because he's celebrating his birthday today. So I've decorated his carrot cake. And this one is for Easter. So I have baked two uh, round shaped carrot cakes that look so good. Smell sweet, smells delicious and ready for a bite. Delicious. So if you want to check the recipe, just check joyofbaking.com. That's where I got the recipe for, for this carrot cake. Thank you all for watching.